This is the toughest food critic on planet Earth. Every step wrong, you can't taste shit. Who want that? And although we have history being pretty uh? shitty chefs on this channel, we want to change that today and attempt to do the impossible. Impress Uncle Roger with our cooking in just 24 hours. His Uncle Roger is coming in about 24 hours and we have nothing planned. So this is what I'm thinking, guys. We're gonna make him a fried rice. Do you have anything in mind? Nasi goreng. That is the fried rice. For those of you who don't know, nasi goreng is Malaysian fried rice. It's a popular street food dish that can be found all across Southeast Asia. And since Uncle Roger has been on the road doing his tour, we're gonna bring nasi him a little goreng. taste of Malaysia. Uncle mm. Roger, proud of Malaysian, Malaysian fried, fried rice. rice. And then we'll add our own fresh yeah, seafood exactly. because they eat a lot of seafood there in yeah. Malaysia. Seafood, nasi goreng. Now that we decided on the dish, it's time to start working. Edward will be in charge of setting up the restaurant, Vines hanging from the ceiling, reminiscent of the jungles of Borneo. I was thinking you got a nice wooden table. And Sheldon and I will be doing the cooking. Okay, the foundation is sample. It's right, it's right, it's day old. And day oh, old. we're gonna make it right now! <laughs> a, a candle. We use a giant banana. Shrimp, okay, calamari, caviar. We're in the restaurant, the jungle uncle. Yes, sir! Let's, Let's go. go. First up, the sample. The most important piece. This is a logan ma of Malaysian people. Key, right? That's in rice. It's on the deep fried shallot thing. <laughs> get <to> this one. <laughs> <laughs> All right, it's gonna be sick. Next step, Next. get the banana leaf. Can I buy a banana leaf? Really jelly, like four dollars each. They sell it. They sell it. <laughs> After spending hours of harvesting the ingredients, I realized that I forgot the most important fried rice item. All right, while Sheldon is finishing up buying the groceries, I am actually going to go buy a wok because we don't have a wok at the house anymore. Pot. Pot. And no woks. These are not woks. These are flat bottom. This is looking like a tough find. You know, you have this kind of pot, right? But the bottom is round, not flat. Is there? No, it's flat. It's flat. This is the worst news I've heard all day with Uncle Roger coming in less than 15 hours. We don't want to be the guys. It's all talk, no walk. <laughs> Get it? No walk. All right, this is attempt number nine. Let's take a look. Spoons, teapots. Nope, no walks. I don't know what to do. Attempt number 10. Look what I found, guys. We did it. We are victorious. The closest thing to a flat bottom is this. We found a walk. Hi, right, guys! Uncle Roger is coming for early lunch tomorrow. Yeah. Sheldon, you and I got to start prepping the ingredients, and Edward's got to start decorating the place. I also want to show everybody the state of our place right now. I'm going to put the blame 100% not on me. The, the thing is, we need to work as a team here. All right, let's get it. Right. Gordon Ramsay filled in the present. Jamie Oliver filled in the present. Canto Mando will impress, impress him. 2003. One, two, one, be the odds! With less than 12 hours left, we had no time to lose. Wait, am I cleaning or who's cleaning? Sheldon is your cleaning buddy. And just when we thought there weren't going to be any more problems, right, this here. happened. I have to go. I have to go. I have to go. I have to go. At eight. At eight? Yeah. Cat, bro. What? Cat. I gotta do it myself. Yo, wait. This is not my mess. This is, this is your collective messes. This is a bad testing you guys said. Sometimes you would eat here, you have the stuff over there, or whatever, and then we all beat it up. You know, after you made that claim, Joy, Joy came here and moved all our stuff out. I told you I had to leave. I leave. What? what do you have to leave, huh? We're filming a video. Why is your personal life so much more important than filming a video? I said, I said it earlier. Really, I said, yeah, I gotta leave. No, listen to me. If you said you have to leave at 8, then why don't you yeah, have to yeah. dinner? Huh? Yeah. If you guys said you have to leave at 8, then why don't you have to eat? This is why I never believe that you never raise your sandy. Cause you just clearly raged! I understand being unreasonable and I'll cool off. No, no, I'm, 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 I'm not trying to cool off. I need to cool off. I need to cool off. I need to cool off. Okay, fine. So sometimes when friends get into fights, okay. we just give each other space. Alright guys, so we just finished cleaning up. And guys, come. Yeah, guys, some. come. Before we uh, go to tomorrow's big day, okay. I want to say I'm sorry. Why? Oh, I'm sorry. Shit. The way I acted earlier was not conducive to a 
a good team. Sorry, sorry, Sam. Sorry, guys. Okay, group oh, hug. We're too used to yeah, yeah. beating. We all we always do a group hug. Good stuff, guys. And tomorrow, let's impress the hell out of this toughest food critic. Okay. Okay. Yeah. okay. On tree, okay? Okay. One, two, two three. three. Beat the odds. You guys ready for the big day? No. 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 <laughs> Fuck it, dude. Just like, strip of defrosting. The stuff's not washed, bro. Don't blame me, man. Yo, I did my job. I just set that up. Huh? Yo, I, 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 I went out to drink last night. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I, 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 20 minutes left until he's here. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay. Oh, shit. Like, contribute, contribute. Bro. <laughs> thank you, Joy, thank you, Joy. Yeah, I need Gatorade before I start, bro. Hungover. Motherfucker hungover, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, my man's dressed up. Uncle Roger, what would you like to eat tonight? <laughs> Uncle Roger is here. He just told me that he's in the lobby, so he's not gonna go soon. Okay, let's get it, guys. Let's get it, let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. Hello, hello. How are you? Oh my god, he's coming. Do you have welcome gift for him? No, I don't. What about this fresh year gang sweater? That's a great idea. Legend has it that once a year, on a special Black Friday, Yeet Hey Gang and the entire in between store goes on sale. That's true because our Black Friday sale starts now. Save with Black Friday deals on Yeet Hey Gang at InBetweenCM.com or hit the link below to join the Yeet Hey Gang and support the channel. Remember guys, there's limited stock for a limited time only, so shop quick and then come back for the rest of the video. In between, rep your culture and show the world. Right here, is this, this shit? You live like this? <laughs> what is this? Some Canadian refugee camp? Hiya! Salamat the tank. What? Salamat tatang. Oh, thank you. Thank you. You try your best. Kaba bae, kaba bae. Look at this cantonmento. They tried their best. Please have a seat. Why you dress so nice? And like you, estate agent, trying to sell me this house. Welcome to the jungle, uncle. Here are our esteemed chefs. Chef Sheldon Ho, who uses the spices of the Malaysian highlands very, very well. And this is Mike. He's an expert at Malaysian seafood. Okay, okay. Nice to meet you. I'm going to check out your channel. No cooking video at all. You just talk about women. Ooh. This is the special menu that we curated for you. Look at this guy wear a suit and then Santa. What is this? <laughs> Catfish people on Tinder. Okay, Malaysian fire rice for you. You gonna make fire rice? Uncle Roger, a bit skeptical. Oh. And <laughs> you cooking on table. Look at that camera. Pet over the <laughs> cooking on this eBay table. Hi. <laughs> 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 Just to clarify, this table is actually from Facebook Marketplace. Facebook <laughs> Marketplace. <laughs> is that even worse? Poor people like you go and take it. <laughs> stay strong, stay strong, stay yeah, strong. Better yeah, place his order first. Oh. Oh, order what? The one thing on menu. <laughs> Oh, the what? Oh, what? Okay. Let's start. Would you like water? Would you like a uh, hibiscus kombucha? Ooh, hibiscus kombucha. Okay, okay. And coffee okay, also. Right. Coffee. Also. Chef, Early. chef, chef. <laughs> coffee, coffee, coffee. Wait, why are you looking at me? Just come, 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 come. They live in this house. No coffee. <laughs> yo, yo. I, I, I have Do you know why we got hibiscus, by the way? Malaysian flower. <gasps> right, does this impress you? That's the attention to detail. That good start. Good start. Hi, this is very common nowadays. I'm sure. <laughs> uh, Uncle Roger, we got the most important thing for you. For you. Uh, good luck. That, that looks so new. You never used it. <laughs> Here you go, Uncle Roger. Thank you. A good appeal for today. Mm. Is it good? Yeah, it's good. Good. Okay. Good. Coffee will be better. But this okay? Coffee. Yeah, it's made coffee. I don't know how to make coffee. I don't know how to make coffee. Just go downstairs to Starbucks. Right. <laughs> <laughs> so for today's curated menu, we actually have a very special catch of the day. If you'd like to select your protein. Oh, for you, it's still alive. They pretend it's some fancy restaurant with choices. Look at this. It's just one lobster. So would you like this lobster? I'll take this one. That's oh, that's choice. great. That is great. That's a great choice. <laughs> How's the restaurant experience so far? Uh, 50-50. Yeah, okay. Okay. Roger been to better places. Oh, <gasps> I know what will make him feel better. And Roger, please, please. Uh, give me one second. I'm full point. I'm not really covered I have something for you. What is this? It's, it's just your dining mate for tonight. It's orangutan. Orangutan. Okay, okay. <laughs> this Malaysian monkey. <laughs> this remind me of you. You look like him. Look at this. <laughs> I don't think that people like uh, Jamie Oliver or uh, Gordon Ramsay would get you a, a fabulous orangutan like this. No, no. Jamie Oliver, don't even talk to me. He too scared. He's too scared. 
Nice, thank you. This is the best thing about this restaurant so far. <laughs> oh shit! Is somebody here with the coffee? Yes, yes, yes. So, cool, cool, cool. Just do it. I'm just I'm already watching you, Just bro. do it, bro. I'm not drinking coffee. Not bad, not bad. It was, actually, it was actually made by a fan. Dude, it's uh, nice, 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 nice. He, he, he already sure, selected sorry. his catch of the day. Alright, pretty catch of the day, yeah? Yeah. yeah. Good choice, Uncle Roger. Oh, the lobster bigger than the pot. I, uh... <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> lobster don't have central nervous system. They can't feel pain. You know this? <laughs> Checkmate vegetarian. Checkmate. <laughs> I just wondering how long before you notice. <laughs> <laughs> what you season a cold pan? Yeah, you season a cold pan because if you season it too hot, it's gonna start splattering around. No, it don't. <laughs> think that getting too hot now? You think it's too hot? Yeah. It might be too hot because you're in the building. Hey. <laughs> yeah. Okay. The shallot or onion? Huh? Sesh <laughs> You're not gonna cook evenly. Wait, you you didn't peel the shrimp? No, 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 no. It's flavor. The skin has flavor. And Uncle Roger he says, "Why the shrimp not peeled? It's on you, okay?" Okay. Now, now we put we put our sambal sauce. Wow. Malaysia's sambal, okay. Sambal olive is more Indonesian, but it, okay. Uncle Roger, accept this. <laughs> no. Like you feel, you feel that feeling, right? Hmm. How's lobster doing? Lobster's doing good. Doing good? Egg in. See, he fucked up again. He forgot the egg. That's why it's day old rice. Ah, nice, nice. Still really wet though. Yeah, it's, it looks so clumpy. I, uh, yeah, you didn't dry it out enough. What? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, <it's laughs> <true. laughs> yeah, I'm drooling because I'm. I'm sticking making... to your hand. Sticking to your hand. <laughs> don't worry, don't worry. It's part of the theatrics. Wrong ladle, you have to use the round bottom ladle. And then, of course, we gotta add our homemade sweet soy sauce. Mm, sweet very, soy sauce. Very important nice, in this nice. dish. See, look at the consistency. Mm. Oh, wow. Yeah. Sweet soy sauce. Pour it like that. Now, that one clump of rice is gonna be super sweet. <laughs> Taste this amazing yeah. dish. Mmm. Good. Nice. Mm. Nice, 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 nice. Amazing. A little more sambal. Do you guys cook for your girlfriend? Uh, no, I sometimes. can't tell. Huh? Really? Sometimes. You cook for your girlfriend? Yeah. You subject them to this? <laughs> <laughs> Uncle Roger, how's it looking so far? Uh, uh, guys, uh, things don't look that good right now, man. Professional support. <laughs> the tag still on. Never used before. <laughs> oh, banana leaf. Nice, nice. This is what Uncle Roger called all style, no substance. <laughs> oh yes. Mmm. Loves to look good. No, where's the tooth? Give it towel. Ouch. See, can't even take it out. Tong from IKEA. <laughs> I know. After my ex-wife take my house, I have to buy all the shit from IKEA. It's amazing. It's, ama it's amazing. It's amazing. Finally. <laughs> I mean, there's only one pick from me. Wait, wait. We want a fried egg on top. Mmm. Right? Okay. Fried egg in this dirty <laughs> wok. Good. That what happened when you only own one wok? Wait, Mike. We also got the other important ingredient Uncle Roger needs: fried shallot. Shallot. Oh, true, 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 true. Because onion is poor man shallot. Oh. Yeah. Oh, correct, correct. Nice. nice fried Great egg. Right. Use enough oil to actually looking okay. Oh. What did I say? Okay. You see that? Okay. But you need to cook the top. You do like this, the side gonna be burnt, the top not gonna be cooked. Don't. You use spoon, scoop up some hot oil and put on oh, the Oh, sure, sure. See? Then that, that's how you cook the top of egg. Oh, so yes, cook it. Uncle Can Roger I, I... got the magic hand. <laughs> Stop. Just the house and Oh, wow. So unique, you might have to cook your egg. No need for anyone to look at the egg right now, okay? okay. Huh? Why the fuck is he doing this? <laughs> Mike, <laughs> it looks so sad. The steam gonna make it soggy. Oh my god, look exactly like Jamie Oliver fried rice. <laughs> and now you know the technique, how yeah. to cook the top of egg. Yeah, now, now we're really gonna cook egg, okay? One more oil. Good, good. Oh, how's, how's the last one? Looking good, right? How's it looking for Roger? I think it look okay. Uncle Roger pleasantly surprised. Oh, the cracking. He practiced this before? Hey, my Uncle Roger. Yeah. Good, good. <sighs> Hurt my hand. Ah, oh, Uncle Roger, just compliment too early. 
Nice. <laughs> For you. Wow. Not bad. Good job. Yes. Okay. Ah, that good. How's it looking so far? Now it's starting to look a bit better. Uncle Roger pleasantly surprised. Mm -hmm. You took my microwave. Yeah. What's up? Why you give me the whole lobster? Just give me the lobster meat. This is not SpongeBob. I don't need lobster yeah, yeah, yeah. in there. Come on, Sheldon. You can do it. You can do it. Nice. Ooh. Nice. Oh, you're cool. Alright, ready to go, baby! Uncle Roger. Usually when you serve food, you want to light candle, okay? But don't get scented candle. Stupid candle here. <laughs> For dinner table, get unscented candle, niece and nephew. Mmm. Have a seat, Uncle Roger. Okay, okay. <sighs> Guys. <sighs> Moment of truth. Ooh, so sticky. Hiya. This rice stickier than teenager's sock. <laughs> That's how you did it, Mike. But first, it's time to give some money to one of you guys. Raymond is a Cantonese subscriber who doesn't speak Mandarin. Hiya, why you don't speak Mandarin? So for every 15 seconds, I tell him about the secret method to hack learning Mandarin, I'll give him 20 bucks to our merch store. Sound good? Sounds good. Okay, so the copy and paste method is the best way for Cantonese speakers to get speaking Mandarin within six weeks. That's because the method takes your existing Cantonese and shows you how to convert that over to Mandarin, copying over the same sentence structure, key vocabulary, and even tones. That's something that traditional learning methods don't teach Cantonese speakers to do. So that's why they never worked for you. There you go, you got another 20 bucks just now? How can I be so sure this works? That's because before this learning method, I failed for years trying to learn Mandarin. Now, I'm fluent. Not only that, but here's examples of tons of other people who have used this exact method and are now speaking Mandarin within weeks. For example, there's Regina Ting Chen who says this course is exactly the push I needed and who is now looking forward to continue expanding her knowledge of both grammatical structure and vocabulary base using an asset she didn't realize was already there being a Cantonese speaker. Or Belinda Kemp, who's finally achieved her goal of being able to talk to her mom in Chinese. Or Aiden, who within two months has been able to learn more Mandarin than five plus years of classes. All right, that's uh, $20 more for you. But why am I telling you this now? Well, it's Black Friday, of course, which means this whole program is on super sale with 50% off. But I know you still might be skeptical, so we're offering a free lesson to get you started with the basics of the copy and paste method speak Mandarin. No charge, just free so you can see how it works. You can't beat that kind of Black Friday sale, can you? Just hit on the link below to start using the copy and paste method and start speaking speaking Mandarin. Oh shoot, $20 more for you. Oh my god. You're almost, you basically, you basically got a free fresh Hey You Hey Gang hoodie. <laughs> Alright guys, just a reminder, it's only for us lucky Cantonese speakers, and you can be of any level, so Raymond, even if you can't read or write, you said you're jokesing yourself, right? Yep. Yep, if you can't read or write, you can totally use this program to learn Mandarin and improve your Cantonese ASAP. It's gonna work for you, it's made for so, you. So, sorry everyone else who doesn't speak Cantonese, this is not for you, but for you, you got it, alright? And yeah, you, you, you wanna know, you wanna know how many bucks, that's it, I'm done. <laughs> Holy crap. Yeah, rice not very good. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> Egg over fry. This is your fully, fully solid. Oh, no. hmm? But at least you got good crunch, so still okay, still okay. What is this? <laughs> Hiya, I still have to peel the prawn. And you didn't dewain the prawn. Hiya. No, not gonna eat that. Not gonna eat that. Okay, gonna try this. Oh, yeah. Oh, lobster overcooked. Look at this. Too hot. Can't even cut. Uh, that's because you don't have a knife. Don't teach me how to eat. Okay. My uh, texture too rubbery. There's uh, this as well, the butter sauce for lobster. Butter right sauce. There. You think this gonna fix it? Where? <laughs> okay. So pretty good. Good job. Good job. <laughs> Not the best fried rice, Uncle Roger have, but I appreciate the effort. Do we impress you? Do we impress you? Mm. Not really. <laughs> Just be yourself, you don't need to impress me. This is what people say they're losers. Yeah. <laughs> Just trying to be nice here. You know what would make us feel better? If you guys click here to watch another video or click here to watch a video that YouTube thinks you'll love.